for coming into the embassy today. Yeah. Um, no, I understand that you received a three thousand dollar grant from the from the U.S. Embassy in our Mandela Washington fellow cohort. Was it two thousand sixteen or two thousand seventeen? Two thousand seventeen. Yeah. Okay, good. And with that, you launched your company in your career. Yeah. Yeah. In fact, uh, we started in a social initiative mm -hmm. called Afro EDX Technology. Okay. Focus on initially on edutech, education, how we can bring uh, innovation in terms of. Uh, tools like virtual reality. Uh, but initially, um, we did not realize that cost would be a, a big issue. But we tried to do it because uh, in education, where people are in rural area like in South Africa, uh, rural area in Wulungula, for example, they don't really um, have the vision, how they, the image that when they are, they are learning some concept. So with the virtual reality, when they put the goggles, they are transported to the area. Let's say the teachers are explaining something. It's, it's very easy, very easy for the kids to very memorize and to understand that in, in print the image. So that let's say when you are visiting somewhere, you can easily remember the place. That's, that's, that's the power of virtual education. So this is a fantastic good news story, a story for Africa and the African continent as a whole. Yeah. Um, I'm curious you know, for our Mauritian audience, what do you have in store for Mauritius? Yeah, so we, we started with, uh, in parallel, some how to implement the virtual reality in education in a primary school in Pelaval. So we, we tried to showcase how the parents, the teachers, the kids can really um, use the platform, the Google Expeditions at the time. Uh, uh, at the same time, how they can also create content. And, and we, we started that. And we also realized how the challenge with the COVID-19 was to share the, the Google Cloud, the Google Glass via headset with the kids in the class because of health and so on, and also the um, health issue. So you need to, to clean. This is an issue. That's why we couldn't go far with this project. But we understood that this project we can put it at a later stage because maybe this technology was too early. You know. When you, you, you use something, it's too early in terms of deployment because the deployment is, is, is a huge cost. Yeah. That's great. So again, thank you. I know, I know um, I'm excited to see where you take your business and your, your, you know, all of your ideas is in Africa as well as here in Mauritius. And I look forward to meeting you again soon. Maybe we can talk about where you're going from here. Yeah.